And so we are. Good morning, Florida. Today, you guys. Good evening. Good morning, everyone. Welcome back to my channel. I have a good news, guys. I changed my name in my niche in my YouTube channel tonight. My new name, my new niche is my travels and my digital business journey. Amen. Oh, amen. Yep. And may that rocket yep. at the Cape Canaveral Space Center take off sooner or later. Hopefully sooner. You can see it right behind the travel and business guru, digital business guru's head. Yes. Near Merritt Island National Wildlife Refuge, Florida. Really great place. One of the best places in the country for bird watching down this causeway. But let's get going to the wildlife refuge. See you guys later. We're going to have a picnic lunch. Maybe, maybe we can get a better vantage point on Merritt Island where we're supposed to go hunting for the launch. Let's, let's eat. Yep. It's chilly in South Carolina, around 10 degrees Celsius, 50 Fahrenheit. It's like 20, 30. It's like summer here. Let's go change. Daming Uwak Mala E. You see the female, honey? The girl? The girl is like rusty red. Rusty red. Yeah, rusty red. Baba A na Uwak Mali. We're getting towards the Merritt Island National Wildlife Refuge. Very, very one of the best bird watching parts of the country. So we're getting close to that. But first, let's show you where the rocket is if it ever takes off. Maraming <laughs> Uwak. Tama. It is right there. You see the. The white towers, it's like kind of like there's a tree and it's right in the center right there. You'll see it well on the big screen. Let's go. Let's go do some duck and manatee hunting though. <laughs> yeah, we saw the rocket. We'll take off when it's ready. Where are we bird watching, honey? Merritt Island. Yeah, Merritt Island National Wildlife Refuge, the best place for birding on the East Coast, in my opinion, is for species diversity and stuff you can't see anywhere else in America. <laughs> Including, what do you like? What's your favorite kind of bird? <laughs> spoon bills. Yeah, it's like your shirt. It's the spoon bills. Spoon bill, the pink spoon bill. Yep. It's the rosiest spoon bill, which means pink. Rosiest, like a rose. Hey, let's go up and see if we can see any from the overlook. A lot of spoonbills here. Yeah, let's see if we see any today. Yep. Tell them a little more about the spoonbills, honey. A lot of spoonbills in Florida. Pink, different kinds and different colors. Very nice. All right, let's see if we get lucky here. If not, maybe the manatee deck. Hey, yeah. yep, shout out to all the bird watchers again. Uh, one of the, the best places for birding on the East Coast, in my opinion. I've been coming here since I was like 13 years old. This is, um, like, I think you can see every kind of heron species in America here, too, and egret. And the spoonbill is a lot like a heron, but it's, it's, it's like, shaped like you, you eat, like you eat soup with, or synagogue, and it's, like, it's, it's getting synagogue out the water. It's the, you know, nasa putik buloka, the, the little, little buggy things. Yeah, microscopic animals. So let's go see what we see. You can see all that kind of birds here. Oh, I forgot my binoculars. Here, guys. Oh, I see some. standing there. It's a tagak. Um, it's it's a heron. Probably like a little blue or losing it. It's hard to say. I need to get my binoculars. So he's right there in the middle. Um, these are mostly, um, well, it's the yeah, the egret, the heron. Um, yeah, it might be this one out there. Let's get my binoculars and see. Okay. But we might have to find spoonbills in another overlook. He's running. Yeah, running, running. I think it's a Louisiana heron. It's not a, yeah, or tricolored heron. It's not a little blue. He's running. He's done. Her. Hello. 
<laughs> yeah, I think we need our binoculars. Look what we found. Show them, honey. Uh, <laughs> this one. This one? Yeah. That's what we're looking for. You like it? Yep. Let's go check it out. Already. There they are. Rosie at Spoonbills. thing of beauty right there doing her reels I don't need my binoculars because I know that's a, when I was a kid I called it an ugly bird they're actually kind of rare when I was a kid but 30 years ago I started coming here but now they're quite common one of the few that have become more common they're swish swish swishing with their spoons getting the Kumayin Nasa Putik Ang Bloka Malai the little animals like yeah he's right there Mabaho Mukong Putik Bulokba. Yeah, it's be be birds are too beautiful to even care. Okay, let's get out of here, honey. That was beautiful. So guys, shout out to all bird watcher. This is the best place in Florida. Yep, if you're ever on a business travel trip, you'll be sure to stop by here. Yes, a lot of spoon bills here. Rest in peace to my grandfather. He used to contract here by the Cape Canaveral Space Center. Welcome to Florida.